Today we'll be talking about the recently announced Commodore 64 Mini, so please stay tuned. If you grew up in the 80s or 90s, you probably had or knew someone that owned a Commodore 64. After the NES Mini and the SNES Mini, and obviously the Sega Genesis from At Games, this time was announced the Commodore 64 Mini. The Commodore 64 was released in 1982 and until today was the computer that sold more Unix in the world. 35 years after, it looks like we are getting the Commodore 64 back. The C64 Mini, how is it called? It's a tiny but perfectly formed and it's a 50% scale replica from the original machine. It features high definition output via HDMI and it comes with a classic style joystick. And obviously with games, with 64 built-in games. This is huge news and I don't think someone was expecting something like this, but if we think about after the success of the NES and the SNES, it makes sense that someone will, would come up with something like this, since there is a huge demand for retro uh, collecting items. But what else do we know about the C64 Mini? Supposedly it does accurate C64 operation, it has pixel filter options, and it comes with two USB ports where you can plug in a USB keyboard and use it as a full functional home computer or add the second joystick to, for two player games. So I think what's left is to check some of the games available. So let's quickly check the Nebulous. the Awaki and insects in space. The price it's not known at the moment. I think we will have to wait until we get some more news related with that. What was also announced was a full size, full working version of the Commodore 64 coming in 2018. So that's huge. I mean, besides the fact that you we will get a, a, a mini version, we'll get a full size version. So we will need to see what it will do. I feel that 2017 it's been a great year and it's, it has been a fantastic year to be a retro gamer, retro gamer and a collector. And I'm stoked, I really, I don't think, as I said, that someone was expecting this, this news, but it, this is huge and I feel that uh, it's the right time to, to come up with something like this. So please, tell me, what do you think about this news? Are you interested in buying a Commodore 64 Mini? Does this make sense to you or you are more into console collecting, retro console collecting? Please let me know in the comment section. Until next time. If you like this video, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and like.